I kind of want to sleep for six years. But I have to get up. Okay, I kind of feel crappy today, so I'm just going to lay here and chill and do some random filters for spooky season with you guys. Okay, I'm going to try to save these final girls. Okay, yeah, I'm going to save Gail. Uh, I feel like I want to save Carla. Uh, yeah, I want to save Kyle, too. I'm in my Chucky phase. Uh, I'll say no to Kristen, just because I haven't seen that movie in a long time. Grace, hell yes. Lori, oh no, I have to get rid of all of these now? Maybe I did this wrong. That's fine. I don't offhand know what Tina's from. I'll have to Google it. Mm, Alice, that's too bad. But, you know, gotta do what you gotta do. And Julie, I haven't seen that movie in forever. I don't hate this list. It's not horrible. What is Tina from? I'm gonna Google that. Okay, apparently she's from one of the Friday the 13th movies. I don't know if I've seen the one that she's in. Scream Bracket? Yep. Um, that guy. Oh, God, I don't like either one of them. I guess she was less annoying. Cindy. Oh, definitely. Do we? Tatum. Roman. Cindy. Do we? Tatum. Oof. Cindy. Oh, the siblings against each other. I love Tatum. Sorry. <gasps> oh, no. I'll have to go with Sydney, but I love Tatum so much. That's not surprising. Okay, so who's the scariest? Would you believe I've never seen that movie, like, all the way through? Um, but still kind of scary, so we'll go seven. Chucky just cracks me up, but still, a doll is creepy. So, I guess I'll say five. Michael? Mm-hmm. I guess we'll do one. Pennywise... Creepy Clown, six. Uh, what in the backwoods? That is terrifying, and I'm not even sure which movie that's from. We're gonna do a four on that. Leprechaun, hmm. Ghostface, oh, it's my favorite, but not as scary. Oh, well, three. Freddy, we'll do two, because I like sleep. Oh. Jason should have been higher. Oh, Jigsaw. Screw that guy. Okay, this one I'm doing if I think I could win against them in a fight. Chucky. Mm, I think I could probably take Chucky. So... I'm gonna put that as a two. Freddy, I'm gonna say seven because, you know, Jigsaw, I don't want to play his games. So, I feel like eight... Mm. Michael, another physical person that I can maybe try and beat up, but still, ugh. Jason is massive, man. I don't think I could take on Jason. Um, I guess we'll go 10, so I really can't do the jeepers. Ghostface, I, I think I could take him. Pennywise, I'm not a kid anymore. Leprechaun, I could drop kick. And I don't, what is that creepy? Is it like wrong turn or something Ugh. my zombie apocalypse team Logan mm. I think we're gonna go with Tyrion he's got the plans man um we'll go with Thor um maybe he'll help Tyrion with the plans and he's my final that won't really do me much yet, no, will it? Okay, I'm gonna try it again. We'll go with the flash. <laughs> I feel like maybe some strength there. I don't know who those people are. Oh wait, no, that's that, sh we'll do the shooter guy from the Olympics. Um, <laughs> maybe the brains. And Logan. Okay, cool. Oh. 
Okay, ranking Halloween foods and if I'd eat them. Candy corn isn't horrible, but not my favorite. We'll say a six. Popcorn ball? Mm, we'll say five. Not my favorite, but... You know, those are actually really good. Like childhood nostalgia right there. But I'll put it at a seven. <gasps> Pumpkin spice? Heck yes. I'd Caramel apple? Heck yes. Oh, those are really good too. We'll put it at four though. M&M's I love all year round, but I feel like there could be better Halloween foods. Witch fingers? I can't do that. That looks nasty. Nine. <laughs> sour gummy worms? I don't like sour stuff. Pumpkin bread? Mm. Perfect. Okay, I'm gonna rank these on if I would wear these as a costume. Like a deer? It's cute, but like not my favorite. Like we'll say an eight. That's cute. I like that. Cheetah. Mm, I loved me some cheetah girls back in the day. We'll say six. That's cute. Uh, five. Mm, I guess I'll just put that seven. I don't like the purge stuff. That's cute. Three. I don't like Avatar, although the makeup that people do is absolutely beautiful. I just don't personally like Avatar. Um, she's from the new Beetlejuice that I haven't seen, <laughs> but I guess she's number two. Oh, and Corpseide, I've cosplayed before. I actually follow that cosplayer. <laughs> I guess we're ranking candy? Milky Way. Yeah, I'll keep that. Jolly Rancher is one of my faves. Solver Taffy is good too. Tootsie Rolls I can get rid of. Whoppers aren't my favorite. Skittles, mm, hit or miss, hit or miss, hit or miss. I'll say no. There might be something better. Like M&M's. Ooh, Musketeers are good too. Mm, I guess I'll say yes. I'm scared. Oh, Kit Kat could have been a cape. Oh, Reese's Pieces too. That was an absolute fail. Okay, ranking couples costumes by if I would wear them. That's adorable. Would totally wear that for. Nah. I think I'm good. Nah, we'll say nine. That one is so overused, but at the same time, it's kind of funny, but we'll just say an eight. That's disgusting. Definitely would do clowns. <laughs> I love that. We'll do a five. Oh, one. Absolutely. <laughs> That's actually cute, but we'll say six. What is this supposed to be? A cloud? What are the pictures? I don't understand. Seven. Why is that number two? No! Why is that a costume? <laughs> Why is that my number two? No! Okay, my last one ranking costumes on if I'd wear them. The Hooters girl, that's just a little boring for me, but we'll say eight. I don't want to be a rat. No. Would 100% do Barbie? I love that Barbie look too. That's cute with a friend. Five. Hello? No. <laughs> uh, seven. Super cute. I doubt I'd ever do it, but you know. Oh my god, I would totally dress up as a sushi roll. A bagel is so random. Yes, Patrick is number one, absolutely. Okay, I'm done now with the crazy filters. Chapel Roam, while I wait to get a Sprite. I love Sprite, it always makes me feel better. And my mom needs a Sprite, she doesn't feel very well today. So, I'm gonna grab that before I get to work. Hi, you wanna sit there while I draw? So, I have been watching way too many hurricane videos and I'm super worried for everybody. Um, my friend that lives in Florida, she says she's safe, so I just gotta trust her um, that she's in a safe area or whatever, but I'm just so stressed for everybody. And then my algorithm's like, oh, you like natural disasters, <laughs> and it starts talking about how like seismic activity up here in the Pacific Northwest with some of the mountains and I'm just like don't do it I tell you we gotta be nicer to Mother Earth because she's pissed right now and I'm like oh my god please don't blow 
please. Do not blow. I did not live through Mount St. Helens. I was not alive. But I have seen Dante's Peak way too many times. Although when I was a kid, I did see Mount St. Helens, like, doing this little eruption thing. That was, like, just this, like, little poof thing. I was actually on the way to a basketball game. And we were like, oh, no, we don't want to play the basketball game. Is the mountain going to explode again? But, yeah, that's what my FYP is right now. Too concerned about the last hurricane people. And then this one that is currently happening. Because today is the 9th? Today is the 9th. So I am just listening to some music and sketching for my little sketch thing I'm doing this month. Rewatch of a movie I've seen way too many times, but it is the next cosplay I'm going to do. Courtney Shane, played by Rose McGowan. I realized I didn't want to do two brides in a row, so Ready or Not will be after that. So I gotta rewatch before I do my Courtney cosplay. Okay, now I'm watching Cabin in the Woods. Was suggested to me by a few people, so. I like know nothing about this movie except for Chris Hemsworth, isn't it, so. Agatha. That's all I'm gonna say because I'm not gonna spoil anybody, but. Now I am watching Happy Death Day, which I have not seen before, while I do my Courtney Shane makeup for my Jawbreaker cosplay tonight. Can we take a moment to appreciate this lipstick color? What is it? What are you? It's from LA Girl. Do you have a name? Pigment, flat pigment pillow. Okay, I don't know what the name is, but it's so close to the Courtney color that I'm going for from Jawbreaker. It's like perfect. What color are you? Maybe it's timeless. It says that, but I don't know if that's actually the name. But here's the picture. That's my inspiration and the outfit I'm doing. It is the same color. So I didn't really do much vlogging after I got into the cosplay. It was a pretty fast uh, shoot. So that's good. I have to look over the footage, um, and I was gonna edit it, <laughs> but I just got out of a relaxing bath, and I'm just moisturizing my legs, and my feet, my toes. I finished um, Lisa Marie Presley's book with her daughter Riley Keough and uh it made me cry <laughs> it was just i was really interested i i get really interested in certain like people's bios celebrities like autobiographies and this was interesting to me because it was like part of the stuff lisa marie had written before she passed away and then her daughter riley filled in some of the gaps and then added her experience and stuff too so it was a really interesting read and um I listened to I listened to it an audiobook form which I really liked because Riley has like the best voice ever so she kind of read her parts and then Julia Roberts did like kind of Lisa Marie's parts and then there was also some audios from actual tape recordings that Lisa Marie Presley had um, done or whatever I'm not even like a huge Elvis fan but I just like sometimes find autobiographies um, bio was like really interesting and this one was very interesting um the end of the book definitely made me cry obviously Lisa Marie Presley passed away and um it was very well written so I mean if you're an Elvis fan probably check it out if you're a Priscilla fan I don't know if you'll like it because I mean it definitely talks about some questionable things that Priscilla did while raising Lisa Marie so I don't really do like book reviews in these vlogs because I'll do like a full book like review thing later with all the recent books I've read but I literally just finished it and it's on my mind and I'm all sniffly from the ending so thought I would mention it. <laughs> 